What's up everyone, Take Down here. Welcome back to another video. Today, we're gonna to be doing part two for my favorite games from my childhood. I absolutely loved doing the first one, but whenever I was preparing the video for the first one, I didn't realize how many games I absolutely loved from my childhood, and I could not narrow it down to just five. So today, we're gonna to be doing the other five games that I consider as being my favorites from part of my childhood. Let's get straight into this. Up first is a game that I absolutely love because as you guys know, I love racing games, but this is more of a destructive aspect to regular racing games. And that is Burnout 3 Takedown. This is my favorite Burnout game that ever came out. And it was a huge part of my childhood because I remember playing so much with my dad. We used to play, I think, literally only one race uh, multiplayer. And we used to just go and just see if we can take out each other and just destroy each other. My favorite mode for this game, however, was part of the world tour, which I absolutely loved. You basically go around the world and through different intersections, trying to cause the most damage and destruction that you can. The more damage you have, the more money that you cause of destruction, the higher chance that you'll get a higher medal for each round that you do. And it was absolutely fun as a kid going through and just causing a lot of damage, kind of like GTA in a way, but it's controlled intersections type stuff. So it was a lot of fun going and playing this game when I was younger. I honestly wish that they were to remake this specific Burnout game. They did remake Burnout Paradise, but I think this game would be a lot more fun for the world tour aspects. The next game is one from the NES, and that is Blades of Steel. You guys know that I absolutely love hockey and collecting anything hockey. This is a game that's on my radar now. Right now, I do not own an NES. I'm looking for that as well but this is one of the first games that once I purchased an NES I really want to purchase that was from my childhood. There's other games and also ones that I mentioned in the previous video but this is definitely one that I loved playing because I have so many memories of again me and my dad playing hockey together and this was an 8-bit hockey game so it's not like the newer games where they're really graphic forward. The basic mechanics of hockey are in this game and it was a lot of fun and I loved the intermission going and playing, I'm not sure if it was like Space Invaders or something like that, but playing that aspect in the intermission was a lot of fun. I absolutely loved playing Blades of Steel and I have a lot of memories playing it with my dad. The next game is another destruction game and that is Rampage Total Destruction. This was on the PlayStation 2 and I really hope that they one day remake this game. Now, there was an arcade version back whenever arcades were a thing and I never got a chance to play it, but this game however, includes basically the arcade version, but on the PlayStation 2, which was a lot of fun to play the 8-bit version of this game. I'm not really into a lot of 8-bit uh, arcade games, but this one here was a lot of fun. But there's also basically an updated, once again, world tour aspect to this game where you're trying to destroy any city that is throughout the whole world. So you go city by city, uh, country by country and it's a lot of fun just to cause so much damage now There's specific things you have to do each round for example You might have to eat ten clowns or destroy five tanks or different things like that But going through the buildings and destroying certain things was a lot of fun Just the total destruction that you could cause per city was awesome There's a lot of big cities that was in this game that aspect alone was a lot of fun. Now there was multiplayer and I did play that with my dad as well, but I remember more of the world tour aspects, playing that and loving it. I really wish that they'd either remake the game and have a new Rampage game come out on the PS5. I think that'd be a lot of fun and a lot of people would be able to play, but even if they were to remaster this game, I'd be 100% on board with that as well. The next game is another NES game, and that is Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 2, the arcade game. Now, this isn't one of the top games whenever people talk about the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles on the NES, but it was one of my favorite ones because it was a simple arcade style game, a simple 8-bit beat-em-up style side-scrolling game, which was a lot of fun. And again, you could choose your Ninja Turtle, but you could also play with your friends so once again I was playing this game quite a bit with my dad and that's why I put it on this list because I have so many memories of us going now 
I don't believe I ever made it past the first boss, but that was because I was just playing to have fun back then. This is another game that once I purchased the NES, I plan on purchasing, and there's a lot of NES games that I had back in the day whenever I had an NES that I'm gonna be trying to get my hands on once again once I do get an NES, just for the memories and being able to play those games for the memories. But this was a fantastic game. I absolutely loved it. And the last game was from the PlayStation 2 and that is The Simpsons Hit and Run. I absolutely love The Simpsons. It is a fantastic show. And back whenever I had the PlayStation 2, I wanted to get the Simpsons game. Now there was a couple games that came out. So there was The Simpsons Hit and Run, uh, The Simpsons game, and there was another one as two, I think Road Rage. But out of all of them, my dad decided to purchase Hit and Run because he had somebody recommend this game to him. And by far, it is amazing. It's the game that I really want to see remade, whether it's on the PlayStation 5 or even farther down the line. I just want to be able to play this game again. Now, I have tried to find copies of this game, but this game right now, the PlayStation 2 game, is going upwards of $50 on eBay. I actually found one for $5 that was local, but I didn't get to purchase it in time. Somebody else came and got that deal from me. That game, if I would have purchased it, I would have likely played it, but then I would have probably flipped it on eBay or just locally for what the value of it is worth because it is a semi-rare game and for it being a PlayStation 2 game valued at about $50 is pretty impressive for me. I absolutely loved that it was basically an open world style game where you're per level or however far you get into it. There's different missions that you do along the way. I think you start off with Homer, but you can play as Apu, Bart Simpson, uh, Lisa, I think, uh, different characters, and you go through different parts of Springfield doing different missions along the way. A lot of great little small details from the show are in this, and there's a ton of locations from the show in the game as well, which is why I absolutely love it, because it's like a family-friendly GTA style game in a way. So back then I was playing Grand Theft Auto, but I loved playing The Simpsons Hit and Run a lot more because it had to tie in everything from the show and I absolutely loved this game. So this was part two for my favorite games from my childhood. Now, there of course is other games that I could have mentioned, but I wanted to just mention my top video games. And like I said, whenever I was preparing this video, I didn't realize that I'd have two videos worth of games to talk about because there was so many memorable games from my childhood. This one, this video alone has more of the memories that I remember me and my dad playing and uh, enjoying the games and playing together for not only the PS2 but also the NES. And that's why I decided to make part two for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Comment down below what your favorite game from your childhood is. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Please take care. Peace.